Hey guys, this is Epson Workforce WF7840. I want to show you how to scan documents from this printer to computer. First of all, you need to make sure that the printer and your laptop are connected to the same network and you downloaded the necessary software. To scan your document, you need to open up the scanner and stick the document you want to scan on top of the glass scanner face down. You also need to make sure you start, you look on top on the glass scanner, you see a white arrow. Put your document from this, from this end. This is important because if you put it from any other place, the document will be, it will not be full, it will be wrong scan. Okay, so make sure the document is this end, then you close the scanner. Now the next thing you need to do is you need to go on top and select on top and select scan now the next thing is for you to scan you have scan to email scan to computer or scan to memory or cloud or WSD so we want to scan to computer select scan to computer now you will see this information install the Epson scan smart software on the computer to use this feature okay and select OK. So we already done this. Now the next thing to do is you need to select, scroll down to select your laptop and it will pick up the available laptop. Okay, select on it. So the laptop is picked. Now the next thing is you select preview. Then once you select preview, then you select save as JPG or PDF. You need to make sure you select PDF. If you are scanning photo, then you select photo. So what we are scanning is basic PDF. Then also the sec second option is scanning two-sided. If you want to scan this double-sided, double then you need to select double-sided. Okay. Now scan size, select scan size. You follow A4 or letter. So what we have here is A4 and select save. Original will be fed from ADF with current settings. Place the original in the ADF with printed up. So open up this and go to ADF. Stick the document. Okay. Select start. There we go. Scan to computer is completed and this document now is here and the image is here. So you need to select on it this document, double click it and this is the document we scan to computer, double sided, you can see, with ADF. The reason why it asks you to scan with ADF because we are scanning double sided but if you are scanning one side you may just need to do this using the printer scanner and if you want to this is the first okay you can see the documents we scanned here if you want to scan the second one okay you put the document you want to scan instead of selecting double sided we want to scan this one side okay and stick the document you want to scan on top of the glass scanner close it Okay, so make sure it's one sided and select start. Now, this document is scanning. You will see the document scanning from here. I 
and it's done it would show you showing us now scan completed now you, the next thing you need to do once you scan it you need to go and look for the document think the image is here double click it here it is this is the document we scan just one page so something you need to bear in mind is if you are scanning two-sided then you use adf if you are scanning only single side then you use the glass scanner okay so this is how to scan the document and this document will scan now if you want to print it out you select Control p from the printer select Control p to print it out then once you select Control p then you select paper size layout and to print this black colored okay and print on one side select print now this document is going to print from here Here we go. This is the document we scanned to computer and also printed it out. If you want to share this document with somebody, only what you need to do is you need to go to your email, go to Outlook. So open up your email and the email is opened. Now the next thing you need to do, you need to select new. Now type the email address of the person you want to send this document to. And once you type the email address, then you select insert, select file, so select the image, and this document now is attached. If you want to see the image, then you need to double click it, click open for you to see this is the image, okay? And once you don't close it, then you select send. So now this document is sent to my inbox. So this is exactly how this works, how to scan document from Epson Workforce to your computer, print this document out. Likewise, share this document to somebody via email. If you're happy with this tutorial, please do me a favor, like, share, and subscribe. It helps the channel. Thank you very much, and stay blessed.